Hello, guys. How are you? Good evening. Vaya, pues, ya estoy aquí. Okay, Jairo, en vista de que nadie está acá, solo usted, ah, y Nazario, porque solo Hi. usted me contestó, ok, vamos a, vamos a hacer de caso que solamente ustedes están en la clase, all right, how are you, Mario, eh, ja, eh, Jairo y Nazario? Buenas noches, teacher, me, todavía no había agarrado el Inter del todo, ahorita ya. Yo igual. Eh, Hi, good, good evening. Besides, good evening, guys, good evening, Renato, thank you for answering me, guys, qué bueno que sí, ahora sí contestaron, ok, algunos todavía lo que pasa como que no es, con, todavía como que no es con ellos, ¿verdad? So, guys, I'm sorry that I came late, sí, lo siento, vamos a terminar a las y dos la clase porque... Eh, ¿Se acuerdan que nos están presionando para que terminemos la sección 5, verdad? Sí. Yes. Uh -huh. Entonces tuve que terminar esa sección con mis otros alumnos para que pues ya para mañana no digan, mira, no, no hemos hecho eso, ¿verdad? Entonces ahorita lo que vamos a hacer es eso, justamente terminar uh -huh. la sección 5, eh, especialmente los ejercicios y ahí vamos a ir dejando la, los, digamos, eh, videos. videos y todos, eh, ejemplos, etcétera, que no sean parte de la evaluación que ustedes tienen que realizar. So, we're going to do that right now, and I will give you the answers. Entre todos, ¿hay alguien que ha podido terminar la sección 5 por estas fechas? Nadie. I just complete one week ago, teacher, the five section, but I have a little bit a lot of problem with platform because I couldn't complete uh, some exercise. Some exercises? Yeah, some exercises, yeah. But it was okay. wonderful because uh, English Corporativo sent me a messages and told a me message? that it, a message? messages, messages and told me that it was wonderful that I finished the, the section five and finished. They, yeah, I finished. Finished. Uh, The section, five. the section five, the... right? Yeah. Okay. Up eighty percent. Eighty percent. Right. Wow. Eso no es muy. O sea, está bien, pero no es tan como que wow, pero. No, it's but it's not my problem. It's, it's acceptable, it's pero the, sí es aceptable. No, but it's but it's not for my problem. It's for the platform that I told you mm -hmm. two weeks ago. Did you remember? Yeah. But I told you that I couldn't complete some exercise because the platform exercises. I see exercises. I exercise some exercises. Uh-huh. Yeah. Couldn't complete some exercises. Mm -hmm. Right? But it's not for for my it was not your fault. It's not it was... for it's not for my fault. It's for the platform. It's because of the platform. I yeah. know sometimes the platform is a headache and I, I hope know. that we finish, I mean, that we can fix these inconveniences little by little, guys, remember? Yeah, all where... my degrees, teacher, uh, ever, ever and ever, I just complete platform and it's 100%. But in this case, obviously. It was not possible, unfortunately. At least yeah. you completed yeah. the platform. Right. Remember, it was not necessary you to finish, like, um one or two uh, or the two first weeks of the section but it's okay you you have plenty of time to um to review more exercises and to remember oh this is something that i did correctly but unfortunately it didn't um it didn't oh it was not accepted but remember i mentioned that is something that i do not handle all right You need to talk to the people in charge, especially the ones who are the administrators, right? You're right, you're right, but nobody answered me. I wrote to two or three people at least and nobody answered me. I don't know why. It happened to me. Believe me, last time, last Friday, I was like, I had to call my very, very big boss to say, hey, you know, I don't know if I'm going to have classes. It's it's the it's the same day then I don't I still don't know. And he said, "Hey, what happened?" right? And well, he did something and suddenly somebody answered, right? But at the, at the beginning, yeah, it, I was kind of ignored. I'm fortunately necessary. But anyways, 
guys believe me that this is a big corporation that has a lot of situations a lot of students and sometimes that is why probably they they are really really busy even though it you know it's only uh, i only have like a couple of students like 40 students maybe per course i mean not not in this course but i mean per per uh periods right because i have uh two or three groups sometimes some of them are like uh, 15 people, 10 students, 20 students. So sometimes when they text me, I do not, I do not handle, I mean, to answer everybody as, as I would like to. Sometimes we don't have enough time. And of course, it's not that we don't, we don't want to answer. It's sometimes that we sometimes read it and suddenly somebody calls and we're doing something else. Or, so it's like, you, you, uh, you forget sometimes uh, to answer. So we need to press, all right? To push everybody hasta que le contesten, ¿verdad? Y si no, dígame, mire, teacher, nadie me ayudó, ¿verdad? Y ahí, pues, yo ya, ya comienzo, dice fulanito que no sé qué, ya me voy con los meros meros, ¿verdad? Porque sí, para eso estamos, pues, para ayudarles. Si se fijan, ¿quién es la encargada del grupo? Creo que aquí... Hay una chica que se llama Paola, la que nos está presionando. Paola Iglesias. Paola, Iglesias. Paola. Sí. ¿Quién se mete aquí? Diego se mete también, ¿verdad? Y aquí creo que están en el, en la plataforma, digo, en Nátale. el grupo. ¿Verdad? Son, son varios. Entonces, sí, hay que presionar, como les digo, si en algún momento de verdad, mire, teacher, ya, ¿verdad? Les escribí, muéstrenme los, la captura de pantalla. Miren, me dejaron en visto. Eh, ahí vamos a ponerles el dedo porque pues ni modo, ¿verdad? Yo sé que tienen trabajo, pero tampoco nos pueden estar ignorando, ¿ok? Así que lo siento, Nazario, por parte de, pues, de, de, de inglés corporativo también, porque, como le digo, mmm, sí, yo entiendo que estamos muy ocupados, ¿verdad? Pero sí, cuando a veces también no insistimos, es como que, ah, a nosotros se nos olvida, a mí se me olvida. A veces hasta me escriben, mire, teacher, yo no voy a estar en la clase yo. Ok, ¿verdad? y yo estoy preparando mi clase, qué sé yo, estoy haciendo otras cosas, ando manejando, ando en bus, etcétera. O sea, un montón de cosas que podrían pasar. Así que, right now, we're going to finish just the exercises. El primer knowledge check, si no me equivoco, es este. No sé si tienen preguntas de la sección cuarta. Vi que algunos hicieron preguntas, no sé si todos pudieron contestarlas de la sección anterior. Ok, ¿Qué, qué, ¿qué pasó, eh, Ana Silvia? ¿Qué pasó? Que no sé, ese no, ¿a qué se refiere? ¿No pudo? No, teacher, no, es que estoy contestando todavía algunas de la, de la, de la, de la, de la cuarta. De la uh -huh. sección cuatro, ahorita estoy oh, en eso. Ok, pero, sí, por eso creo que también ahorita la semana terminando. pasada hicimos, hicimos pues, eh, terminamos, ¿verdad? Todos los ejercicios, ahí sí yo sé que a veces el tiempo no nos alcanza, se nos olvida o qué sé yo, si pasamos ocupados yo entiendo, pero bueno, no sé si tiene algún error porque si son errores de plataforma, así como le digo, ahí es igual necesario, ¿verdad? Hay que, hay que rep... <risa> yeah. Ahí viene ya. Ya no nos va a poner a resolver la plataforma. Sorry, no guys. Sorry, guys. Don't, wor don't worry. Is... Okay, teacher. Ah, de verdad, qué feo que... Ten, ten... Ojalá que no se me vuelva a, a, a... Pues, quedar el internet ahí pensando, ¿verdad? So, um, lo que les decía, eh, si hay problemas de plataforma, pues eso sí, ya no, ya no puedo, pues, hacer nada yo, pero eso sí puedo reportar, ¿verdad? Porque, miren, me puede ayudar con esta persona porque tiene ese problema. Sin embargo, a Ana Silvia la vez pasada sí contestamos todo, ¿verdad? Creo que la mayoría. Aparte, no sé si tienen dudas eh, de, de alguna. Así para terminar rapidito, le muestro rapidito cuál sería tal vez la respuesta, ¿verdad? ¿Quién, aparte de Ana Silvia, no tengan pena? ¿verdad? ¿Quién no ha terminado? Porque la idea es que... Es, Terminemos, ¿verdad? O sea, yo, vi también que falta. Rebeca estuvo preguntando también algunas. Vaya, nos vamos a ir rapidito a revisar la sección 4, ¿verdad? Los demás no dicen nada, espero que ya los hay, lo hayan terminado. Así que vamos entonces a la sección 4 rapidito para mostrarles las respuestas. Así que 
tomen la captura de pantalla y la próxima vez igual hagan eso, ¿verdad? Cuando nosotros tenemos eh, alguna... Si tenemos alguna, alguna que no hayamos hecho o tenemos alguna duda de qué podría ser la respuesta, podemos tomar captura de pantalla. Ok. Esta sí, creo que esa fue, esa todas lo hicieron, ¿verdad? Esa estaba fácil. El knowledge check de aquí, igual solo estaba de responder así, ¿verdad? People didn't travel. The second one, people used to shop at small stores. Um, the number three, people played the first game of golf. Uh, then, then people work more than 40 hours a week. And the number five, pollution is becoming a serious problem. Number six, most people are going to work at home. And seven, it is doctors might find a cure for a common call. Finally, they will probably be, there will probably be being cities. Oh, I'm sorry. There will probably be cities in space. The next. Ya, tomamos ahí nota, ¿verdad? The next. Ya es el otro que hicimos. Ya, se, ya lo vimos. Ese estaba bien fácil. Ya. Solo estábamos hablando de women, transportation, families. Y eso era todo. Ese estaba súper fácil. That was super easy. Sí, next. Teacher, solo, es que solo hay una. una... 411. Eh, eh, la 411. La 4.4 es la que no me agarra, es la única que me hace falta que no me agarra. No me, no me, aunque le dé enviar, no me, no me da la, no me okay, agarra la de... respuesta. Ok, estas, aquí, así. Ajá, estas. esas. Vaya, vale. pero si sí ya sabe cuál es la correcta, ¿verdad? Sí, sí. Y si se vuelve Voy a salir a y vuelve, hacerlo. salga y ingrese Ajá, nuevamente. Sí. Si le da problemas, repórtelo ahí directamente con y ponga y, y póngales ahí o digamos tagué a Paola a todos los que están de administradores del grupo verdad que y mande la captura de pantalla que no puede enviar esa respuesta ok Rebeca okay. <ríe> everything ok vaya entonces los demás ya estuvo la 411 igual eso está no es sí, muy ya todas esas ya, uh -huh, ya estuvo sí. ok Rebecca, any other question? ¿Alguna duda con la cuatro? Ya estuvo. O la cinco es la que me estaban preguntando. Sí, cinco. Ah, no, pero la cinco no hemos comenzado todavía, chicos. Tengan paciencia. Por eso les escribí, espérense. La... Ahorita vamos a hacer la cinco para que la terminen. Hoy si pueden en la noche, mañana temprano. Ok. Y ya nos quedamos de mañana en adelante con las demás cosas. Ahorita solo nos vamos a, a enfocar entonces en las respuestas de... En las respuestas, ¿verdad? Lo que necesitamos responder de la sección 5. Soy the knowledge check. Ok, read the following uh, phrases, rearrange and use the... Uh, use what it's in bracket. Ayúdeme a leer, please, alguien. Please, please, please. Quiero escuchar su, su, be su bella voz. In this class, you will listen listen to a conversation about jobs and job requirements. Requirements. What? Require. Repeat. Requirements. Yes. Where gerunds and short response will be used. What? ¿A dónde está leyendo? La cinco. Um, the objective. No, pero ¿qué estoy Ajá. enseñándoles, chicos? 5.4. estoy enseñando ahorita. Y entonces, ¿por qué estoy aquí? Ah, sí, es cierto. Perdón. Perdón, me perdí. Lo leo. Uh, yeah, but let's try to speak English, okay? Yes, please read it. Okay. 
instructions. Read Instru the following instruct instruction. instructions. Instructions. Read the following phrases. Phrases. Re ar phrases. Rearrange. Arrange. And use that is in brackets. And use what? In, in, in use brackets. Use what is brackets. In order to make statements. Remember the the e e la e no es esa i i ing form uh from form of the verb thank you so um, let's uh, do the number one you just need to place the or the, the the structure in the order right that's it so let's do number one tenemos el ejemplo, vea, lo que vamos a hacer entonces es ponerlas en el orden correcto. All right, uh, number one, help me read, ok, ayúdenme a leer y me dicen la respuesta, alguien, please. Me, teacher. Thank you, Natalie, go. I don't like by community bus. I think is I don't like commute by commute commute by bus. Oh, entonces solo es solo es esto, ¿eh? así. Vaya. Um, I'll show you if it's necessary just to write. Solo poner esto que está en paréntesis o si es necesario ponerlo todo. Vamos a, vamos a ver qué es, si es necesario. Ok, number two. Yeah, teacher. All right, Nubia. I'm not very good. I'm not very good at learning foreign language. Oh, ok, I don't like community. I don't like commuting by bus. Ok, thank you. So, learning, ¿verdad? Después de, de good at, también ocupamos learning. So, I'm not good at learning foreign languages. Sorry, Rebecca, yo creo que usted es la que me había querido leer. Ok, so, give me, tell me number three. I'm good at solving other people's problems. Thank you. Number four, next. Vaya, pues aquí vamos a estar. Todos I quieren que le di la que le dé la teacher, Glendy. <laughs> I hate I hate working with a group or team. Okay. Ahí lo tiene, miren. I hate working with a group or team. Team. All right. The next, number five. Me, teacher. Thank you, Francisco. Uh, yes. Number five, I can't stand. Um, I think some of these are, uh, I can't stand in. No, I can't stand in. I can't stand sit. Uh, sit in meeting alone. Mm. Sit in meeting alone. No. Yeah. Sit. ¿Qué, ¿Qué tenemos que ponerle? Después de don. Sitting. Sitting, ¿verdad? Ok, sitting. ¿Dónde? En a long meeting, en una larga meeting. reunión. In a long meeting. Sería entonces así el orden, all right? I can stand sitting or sitting in a long meeting. Sin... Number six, the next. Number six, say, I am invested in managing my time better. Good job. I'm interested in, or I am interested in, in managing my time better. Good job. Thank you, Jairo. Number seven. Uh, 
Iron Man, talking us uh, on a talking cell phone. I don't mind. Talking on a cell on, phone. Talking on a cell phone. On talking a cell phone. Talking a cell phone. Talking in a cell phone. Oh no, yes. on a cell phone. Vaya, ¿y Saura otra vez? Talking on a cell phone. Uh -huh. I don't mind talking on a cell phone. No, on a cell phone talking, okay? I don't mind talking on a cell phone. I don't... Sorry, teacher. My in the in the in the talk. world, talk talking the L or or no? It's not pronounced like walking, talking. No, it's silent. Talking. Yeah, talking. talking. Yeah, you don't say tol tol. No, talk talking. Talk talk talk. Muda completamente. And number eight. Tell me. I enjoy eating out lunch every day. Eating it out. Okay. I enjoy eating lunch, eating lunch out every day. Ah, no es eating out lunch, vea, es eating lunch out. Sería, okay? Así sería mejor. Eating lunch out. No es eating out lunch. No sé si así me lo dijo Renato, pero es eating lunch out. ¿Ok? Yes. Ok. Eh, okay. I don't mind talking. ¿Qué hice mal aquí? I don't mind talking on a cell phone. I don't mind the dot. The dot, right? No, it's not the dot. Oh, yeah, it was the dot. Thank you. So I'm not good at learning languages. Foreign. Aquí siempre me equivoco yo. Es GN. Miren GN. Vaya. Hoy sí. Todos la tienen así. Ups. What's going on here? Espérenme. Es que hay algo que no he hecho bien yo tampoco aquí. Okay. Ya que guardarla. Ya la guardan. I'm not good at learning. Very falta. Foreign languages. ¿Qué me falta? Very. Oh, sorry. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Very. Bye. Hoy sí. Chicos, háganlo ahorita si gustan. Ya lo hicieron para que para que les, les tenga ahí completitos, completitos. Ok. Delen ahí, pues. Commuting my by bus. Not very good at learning languages. Very good, ¿verdad? Si se fijan, observen qué error tenía yo para que lo corrijan. Number three, I hate working. I'm sorry, I'm not good at solving others, other people's problem. I hate working with a group or team. Six. Sorry, number five. I can't stand, todos con ING, sitting in a long meeting. Six, I am interested in managing, managing, ve, aquí está el, la palabra, managing my time better. My time better. The next, I enjoy eating out lunch. Perdón. Eating, eating lunch out. Ok, si lo ponemos al revés no le va a salir bien. Sería, so, yeah, I enjoy eating lunch out every day. Sí, yo sé, podemos decir eating, eating out lunch. 
no hay problema. Dijimos que no había problema, ¿verdad? Pero eh, para efectos de que nos, todo se nos, eh, se nos facilite en la respuesta, así dejémoslo. Si gusta, le toman captura de pantalla. Vaya, las primeras cuatro. Ahí está. Commuting by. Good at learning. De ahí de las cinco en adelante. Ahí está. Hasta la ocho. Eating lunch out. Lo único que cambiábamos era el verbo, ¿verdad? Con ING. Any doubt? ¿Alguna duda, chicos? At this time, at the moment, no, right? No. Nice, bye. Espero que ahora sí no tengan problemas con su respuesta. So, the uh, exercise is the, uh, the, uh, job hunting. So, we're going to listen to the audio. And then we're going to answer what they are looking for. What is the job that they are looking for? Or they hunting. ¿Qué es lo que están buscando? Uh, help me read the instructions. Somebody? Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. Listen to people talk about the kind of work they are looking for. They check the job when the job that will be best for each student okay each student each, each student. student all right thank you nice so number listen to the audio and then let me know okay Listening, job hunting, part A. Listen to people talk about the kind of work they are looking for. Check the job that would be best for each person. One, Bill. So what kind of job are you looking for? Well, I haven't made up my mind. I love working with people and I love traveling. I don't want a job where I'm stuck in an office all day. I want to get out and see the world. Are you interested in working in business? That's where you can sometimes make good money. I'm not really interested in making a lot of money at this point in my life. I'll worry about that later. Two, Shannon. What kind of career are you planning for yourself? I don't know. I think I'd like to have a job where I can help people. Everybody else in my family is in law or business. You know, boring stuff like that. That's just not for me. I know I'd like to work overseas, though, maybe in a children's hospital in a developing country, but that's a long way away. I have to get into medical school first, and that's not going to be easy. Three, Ben. What kind of job do I have in mind? Well, I don't want a regular nine to five job. Eventually, I'd like to get into acting, maybe even break into movies, but I guess that won't happen for a while. So what are you doing in the meantime? Well, I work out at the gym nearly every day. I need to be really fit. And I'm taking acting lessons as well so that I feel comfortable in front of the crowd. I just had some pictures taken to show to agents in the city. Would you like to see them? Sure. Page 66, Exercise 5, Part B. Listen again. Answer these questions. One, Bill. So what kind of job are you looking for? Well, I haven't made up my mind. I love working with people and I love traveling. I don't want a job where I'm stuck in an office all day. I want to get out and see the world. Are you interested in working in business? That's where you can sometimes make good money. I'm not really interested in making a lot of money at this point in my life. I'll worry about that later. Two, Shannon. What kind of career are you planning for yourself? I don't know. I think I'd like to have a job where I can help people. Everybody else in my family is in law or business. You know, boring stuff like that. That's just not for me. I know I'd like to work overseas, though. Maybe in a children's hospital in a developing country. But that's a long way away. 
I have to get into medical school first, and that's not going to be easy. 3. Ben What kind of job do I have in mind? Well, I don't want a regular 9 to 5 job. Eventually, I'd like to get into acting, maybe even break into movies. But I guess that won't happen for a while. So what are you doing in the meantime? Well, I work out at the gym nearly every day. I need to be really fit. And I'm taking acting lessons as well so that I feel comfortable in front of the crowd. I just had some pictures taken to show to agents in the city. Would you like to see them? Sure. What is the uh, first job that Bill is looking for? Flight attendant. Flight attendant. A flight attendant. All right. Uh, we're going to listen to that audio tomorrow, and I'm going to ask you some more questions because it's not solo saber qué es lo que busca él. No, vamos a escuchar más para pedirles más detalles, ¿verdad? Qué está haciendo, por qué lo está haciendo, a qué hora lo está haciendo, con quién lo está haciendo, etc., etc. Shannon, what is his ideal job? Doctor. 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 A doctor, right? What about the uh, what about Ben? Model. model. A model, right? Is he modeling today? Nowadays? No. What is he doing? Is he is exercising at the gym mm -hmm. and sending some pictures to the agency? Okay, nice. Thank you. Tomorrow I will make some more questions about this. But right now, we will continue with the knowledge checks for the rest of the section. Help me read the instructions. Instructions, complete the sentences with the appropriate information using because. Okay, appropriate. Appropriate. Good job. All right, using because, dando la razón. Okay, because of this, I want to do this. Okay, or oh, in order to, cuando usted dice because, es como que diga in order to, como para, okay, con la intención de. So, number one, I will do, drop the menu down, okay, or I will drop down the menu and you will choose as an answer. Uh, who wants to do number one? I wouldn't want to be a nurse because I don't like hospitals. Repeat, I don't? I don't like. Thank you. Final sounds. You say lie at the beginning. I don't like hospitals. Thank you. Number two, then David. And then the rest, okay? También todos, todos participemos, guys, okay? No solo con David estamos aquí. I would like to be a novelist. Because I love creative I love writing. Create, creative writing. Creative. Creative. Uh -huh. creative. Creative. Como dijo oh, Renato? Reading. Reading. No. Right. Eso es reading es lectura. Writing, 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 lectura, ok, writing, all right, si decimos como read, reading, se escucha, se escucha como reading, ese es writing, ¿verdad? lo opuesto a, 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 le, a la lectura, eh, escritura, all right, reading, writing, aquí es write, como el de escribir, write, con ing, writing, number three, um, who wants to read it, number three, say, I could never be an accountant because a, what? Accountant. A, accountant because yeah. I am terrible with numbers. Terrible. Ball. Terrible. 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 Good job. Okay. Um, I have a terrible moment, memory. All right, memory. Memory, sorry. So I could be no a uh, good pronunciation, Jairo. Uh, you say accountant, all right? Accountant, okay? Accountant. Good job, David. Repeat it. 
accounting. Super, Isaura. Accountant. Accountant. Mm, accountant. Mm, como que me trago la T. Glendy. Accountant. Ah, very good. Nubia, accountant. Accountant. All right, accountant. Mm, mm, mm. Rebecca. Accountant. Accountant. Eh, pero la T no me la, oh. al final no me la pronuncian. Accountant. 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 Ok, Francisco. Accountant. Good job, Renato. Accountant. Account. Ahí solo dice account. Account. Ac accountant. 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 Muy bien, super. Ana Silvia. Accountant. Good pronunciation, Nazario. Accountant. Super accountant. And Evelyn. La Lulu. All right, number. Oh, so I'm terrible. Four. Terrible at numbers. ¿Quién más me faltó? Somos cuantos. Yeah, yeah, just a moment. We are 13. Ah, pues estamos. ¿Quién me faltó? Uh, um... Me, teacher. <laughs> oh, Natalia. Okay, Natalie. Sorry, Natalie. Account. Accountant. 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 Uh -huh. Accountant. And the, uh, read number four. Who wants to read the number four? I will make a bad waiter. 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 Because I have a terrible memory. Okay. <laughs> All right. Y de repente no le lleva a uno lo que le pide, ¿verdad? Y enojado los clientes. Okay. Here you need to pronounce this like wood. 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 Would you? All right, thank you. Number five, who wants to read it? I could not be an accountant. Show the menu, please. No. Okay. Because I really enjoy traveling. Yes, number five, I could be a flight attendant. Because I really enjoy traveling. Thank you. Thank you, guys. So there is something that uh, I wouldn't be a nurse. I made a mistake. I know that it was there. I don't like hospitals. All right. So that was my my bad. Sorry. The next. So we finished the section five and we're just doing the next activities. That is just a, a <clears> quick <throat> test. Choose the words and instructions. Read instructions. Choose the correct word mm. or phrases to complete it. Thank you. Choose the correct word or phrases. Okay, number one, who wants to read it? Number one, say, if you, if you walk to a work, you pay for the bus. The answer is won't have to. You won't have to? Okay. Yep. If you were to walk. Oh, here, Um. let's see. If you were, if you walk to walk, sorry, if you walk to work, you won't have to pay. Thank you. Number two. Number two say, if you have vacation, you many feel better. And more relaxed. 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 Termina con X, así que es un sonido de T al final. Relaxed. Okay. Relaxed. Uh, vacation. 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 Con V. V -v 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 vacation. 
No son labios. Digo esa vacation. All right. O como dice Jairo, ah, la número dos dice, number two says, if you, if you take a vacation, you may feel better and more relaxed. Okay. Hey. Relaxed. Hey. Relaxed. Ponte. Muy bien. Number three. Vaya pues. Ahora solo Jairo está en la clase. Uh -huh. If you get married, you We'll have less Speak louder, Rebecca. Parece que se está escondiendo de sus compañeros. If you get married, you will have less free time. Married. Married. Thank you. Number four. Fiona carefully plans her days, so she's never late for appointment. She likes to be punctual. Otra vez lies. Pa. Otra vez lies, Glendy. Otra vez lies, Glendy. Pronuncian las Ks, las S, la, todas al final. Aquí me pone plan her, her days y allá en appointments no me mencionó la S. Ok, le agregamos S a donde no están las S y quitamos las S donde tienen que ir las S. Ok, so read again for me and pronounce the final sound. Please pronounce it. Pronunciemos los sonidos finales, chicos. Si no decimos lie, es mentir. Ok, no está de, de gustar. Ok, si decimos... ¿Qué? Fight. Estamos hablando de pelear, no decimos número, five. All right. Eh, ¿qué, ¿Qué más? Tantas palabras, decimos like, está lime, like, life, eh, etc. Entonces, pronunciemos el sonido al final, por favor. Eso siempre acuérdense. Sonido final es el que, des, eh, digamos, que determina qué es lo que estoy diciendo. Porque los sonidos finales nos pueden eh, dar a entender una cosa y, lo, y si no lo decimos, decimos otra. Por ejemplo, tit en lugar de teeth, etc. Right? So read it again, please. No es primera vez que les corrijo esto, chicos, y de verdad que necesito que leamos mejor. Ok, come on. Teacher, uh, I have a question. David? What is the right pronunciation of the second point? Appointments? Uh, no, no, no. Oh. <laughs> the second option. Okay. Uno oh. es creative, el otro es punctual. 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 Okay, Glendy, please read. I want to hear you. Miren, chicos, si les pido que lean es porque necesito que vayamos mejorando, ¿verdad? Para eso estamos aprendiendo. Pues si no, entonces no le corrijo y no lea, ¿ok? Si no le gusta que lo corrija. No hay problema. Aquí siempre hay quienes quieren participar, ¿ok? So. Fiona carefully plans her day. So she's never late for appointment. She liked to be punctual. Okay, pero ahí solo me dijo like, no le puso la S. Uh, like. Tampoco le puso la S. <risa> los demás, los demás chicos, escuchen, likes. Likes. Digan si, eh, si Glendy lo dice like. bien y todo es así, ¿verdad? Si no, así, ¿ve? Vamos. <risa> likes. Ah, ajá. Hoy sí, ¿verdad? No like porque lleva S. Ni lies tampoco, ¿verdad? Lies es otra cosa. Thank you. Las papas lies. Yeah, no. Thank you. Punchua. Punchua. All right. And number five. Who wants to read it? Me, teacher. Thank you, Natalie. Jerry tries to help people and never says no. When someone asks him for a favor, 
he seems like a really generous man. Generous man. All right. Thank you. Says. Aquí es says. Says. Acá. Como le dije, Jairo, how do you pronounce this? Says. Says. Ajá. Mire, si digo says. No, says. 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 Abro más la boca. Says. 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 Says, 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 Natalie. Says. Good job. Y si fuera en pasado, se dice. Said. All right. No se dice said. All right. Se dice said. Said. Solo si es. Si no es en tercera persona, entonces digo. Say. Says. Say. Si no es tercera persona, digo say. Y si es tercera persona, digo. Says. 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 Muy bien. O sea, la Y ahí es muda también. Thank you. Number six. Who wants to read it? Francisco, you raise your hand. All right. All right. Okay. Number six. Amy and Sam get angry easily and almost. Easily. Easily and almost never smile. Everyone thinks they are moody and bad tempered. Okay, bad tempered, thank you. Easily, all right, <clears throat> easily. The... easily. Easily, all right, thank you. Good job. The next. We finish almost, we're almost done. Ya vamos a terminar. Listening. And select the correct answer. Vaya, ustedes me dicen cuál va a ser de, estos, de estas respuestas. Just listen to the audio, right? Units 9 to 10 quiz. Part A. Listen to the conversations. Check the correct information. 1. Sylvia, can you believe that 15 years ago not many people had personal computers? I know. I remember being so happy when my parents gave me a manual typewriter for my 18th birthday. <laughs> yeah, I had one too. It used to take forever to type something. Well, before typewriters, people used to write each other. My mother has some beautiful old handwritten letters. Those were the good old days, huh? Yes and no. Nowadays, email makes it so easy to keep in touch with family and friends. So you wouldn't want to go back to those days? No, I'm very happy with my new laptop. Hey, do you want to buy my old typewriter? I think it's still up in the attic somewhere. No, thanks. Two, I love old houses. I like that they have a past, you know, a history of every family that lived there. But, Marcia, if you buy an old house, you may have to make a lot of repairs to it. Repairs? What kind of repairs? You might have to change the pipes and electrical wiring, or even put in a new heating system. Well, that might be true. But just think of how wonderful it would be to live in such a beautiful old place. But if you stay in your apartment for a few more years, you won't have to worry about moving. You'll have a lot more time to save money for your dream home. Three. So, Jim, have you thought any more about the kind of work you're interested in doing? Well, I've been thinking how I love traveling and... <laughs> so do I, but that's what you do on vacation. No, Dad, I mean... I want a job that involves traveling. Oh, like uh, an airline pilot? Well, not exactly, but hey, you just gave me a good idea. I work well with other people, and I don't mind working long hours, and I'm good at French and Spanish, so maybe I could become a flight attendant. Hmm, a flight attendant. Do you think your mom and I would get to fly at a special family rate? I think so. Great. Four. Do you know yet what you're going to do this summer? Well, 
I think I'd make a good counselor because I really like working with children. I'm going to try to work at a summer camp. Yeah, you'd be great working with kids at a camp. That kind of job isn't for me, though. But, Mac, you like hiking and camping, and you're hardworking. But I'd hate to have the responsibility of taking care of a group of children. And I'm way too impatient to work with kids. Well, what else would you enjoy doing? I really enjoy working outdoors. I think I'm going to try to find a job working at a national park. I'd love to help park rangers take people on nature hikes and things like that. Okay, so for the first option, uh, we have that Sylvia wants. Sylvia is happy with her laptop. Okay. Who's not happy with the new laptop, right? Do you remember? Do you know what the typewriter is? Algunos ni la conocieron aquí. Yeah. También jovencito, ¿verdad? Yeah. No. Solo los de los del 80 para del 80, bueno, ya de los del 90 creo que nadie los vio. No. <laughs> okay. Uh, how do you how do you, uh, ¿cómo se llamaba Nazario? Máquina de escribir. Mecanografía era lo que llevaba ah, uno la, para la materia. La materia, ¿verdad? Qué horrible right. es presionar tan fuerte. Vi, 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 vi. Yeah, I know. So you you see the how same the same letter with the same finger. Yeah. It was right. horrible. It was I horrible. I hate that. Okay. Uh, what about the second? Uh, can you read it for me, Isaura? According to Harry, if Marcia stay in her apartment. La S. Stay. <laughs> Ven, que no le pronuncian la S. Que es prohibido, According teacher, mencionar la S. Ajá. In her apartment. Ajá, ahora la e stays, vamos a hacerla más así, más simple. If Marsha stays, Marsha stays, acordémonos Marcia. que acá no hay una e, pero nosotros tácitamente la pronunciamos. We pronounce the e most like uh, most of the time. So we don't say e stay, okay? We just say, according to Harry and Mark, if Marsha stays, Marsha stays, ahí unimos, acuérdense siempre para le la lectura. Vocal con consonante, hacemos un puente entre ellas y se oye mucho más fluido. Y también no tenemos eso de que eh, stay, ¿verdad? ¿Ok? De, de agregar una letra que no va y acuérdese que lleva la S también. Stays. If Marcia stays in her apartment. One more time, ¿y ahora? Okay. According to Harry, is Marcy stay in her apartment? Otra vez la S. <laughs> de verdad, mire, acuérdense, las S aparte de, de, representan tercera persona, Present, representan también posesión de algo, o los plurales, ¿verdad? responses, watches, ¿ok? Siempre pronunciamos las S, o sea, y los sonidos al final, como siempre insisto, ¿verdad? Ok, come on. If Marcia, solo esta última parte, ¿ok? If Marcia stays seen, if Marcia stays seen, hasta yo me equivoco, ¿eh? If Marcia stays seen, if Marcia stays seen, if Marcia stay in, if Marcia stay in, stay in. Stay seen, stay seen. If Marcia stays in. Ahora sí, excellent. If Marcia stays in. All right, what is the answer? She'll have more time to save her, for her house. house. Okay. Repeat, Jairo. Permítame. Quiero escuchar a Jairo. She'll have more time to save for a house. Okay, to save. A la primera vez solo escuché save. Miren, si no digo save, digo como save, ¿verdad? Si no pronuncio la última V, por ejemplo, save con F, solo digo save, digo decir, en lugar de decir ahorrar, save, save, 
sale, venta, all right? Todos los sonidos finales son bien determinantes, chicos. Y en number three, we're almost done, we're almost done. Es que mejor no practico porque tengo miedo que la teacher me, me, me regañe, como que le duele los, las regañadas que le doy, para que aprenda. So you can learn, guys. Tengo miedo a la teacher. Tan obra que soy, bro. Number Yes. Jim's dad. Okay, Jim's dad. Okay, likes the likes the idea idea of Jim becoming a flight attendant. Okay, para hacerla más rápido podemos ir flight attendant. Flight attendant. Estas tres, si, te, si se fijan que, que en muchas ocasiones y casi siempre los americanos dicen flight up. O sea, como las pronuncian como una R, ¿verdad? Flight attendant. And number four, Mac. What's the answer? Wants to get a job at a national park. Thank you. Good job. And then we're doing the number. Do, 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 do. Vamos a terminar este rapidito. I'm not very good at. Typing. Oh, I am. Oh, I am. Oh, I am. I am, ¿verdad? Muy bien. The number yes. two, I like working with computers. So do I. So do I. So do I. Do I. I like. So I. No so veo do do I. el verbo so be I. aquí, yeah. entonces es do. I don't mind driving. Uy, chica, ¿cómo es que me oían? Okay, I don't mind driving to work every day. Neither do I. Neither do Neither I. Do okay, I. muy bien. Thank you. Uh, what are you? What else? What else? What else? Remember, guys, we finished the class two, uh, uh, a few minutes later since the class started a little later too. Choose the adjectives. Uh, help me read. Uh, the, 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 um, Natalie. Fiona carefully plans her day, so she's never late for appointments. She likes to be a uh, creative. No, la acabamos de poner ahí. No. Si no quiere que llegar Punchual. tarde, es puncho. Ay, Natalie, Punchual. no te ponemos atención. Punchual. Jerry, the, tell me the number two. Uh, Ana Silvia, one, two, three. Permítame, teacher, ahorita. Ya, es, ya hicimos trying. esa parte. Ajá, solo es de responder rapidito. Yes. Jerry, Jerry tries to help people and never says no. When no, somebody... thank you. Vamos no. a decirle a alguien más, Rebeca. Re repitamos porque ya dijimos cómo, re cómo decir esta palabra. Por eso la, cor la, la... No. interrumpí. So, Rebeca. Jerry tries to help people and never says no. Yo. When someone asks him for a favor. General. Thank you. General. Says, says, ¿verdad? Yes. Ya lo, lo dijimos un montón de veces. Fíjense, fíjense para que vean que no, que por eso es que yo me digo, es como que, ¿qué pasa, verdad? No ponemos atención, chicos. Por eso me apaga la cámara, porque no ponen atención. Y después dice, sí, aquí estoy, teacher, nada. Amy, number three. Ah, 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 David, ahora no me ha participado mucho, mucho, mucho. Igual <risa> Evelyn, ahí está de choto, bien, de choto. And Sam, and Sam. Amy and Sam get angry easily and almost never smile. Everyone thinks they're bad tempered. All right, mire, qué difícil esos ejercicios, los mismos de, la, de lo que acabamos de ver, ¿verdad? Yeah. Ok, y por último, the last one, matching, ok. Ah, uh, let's do it together. I like to work as a as an English teacher because because I am very patient and enjoy helping people learn. All right, patient. Repeat it, Jairo. Patient. Patient. Mm -hmm. Patient. Patient. Thank you. Continue. I wouldn't want to be a flight attendant because. Because I don't like oh. to travel or work with people. All right, with with people. Repeat it. Because I don't. Because I don't like uh -huh. to travel. 
Ahí está el like, ¿verdad? La K al final. Very good, novia. Number three. I would, I would make a good, right? Uh, I would make a good waiter. Because I have an excellent memory. And like right. meeting people. Okay, nice. Number four. I could never become a doctor. ¿Qué piensa Evelyn? Wait, 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 wait. Hoy vamos a hacer un reporte. Ah, ahí está, hoy sí es, hoy sí respondió. Ajá. What's the answer? Porque tengo un poquito más de la garganta. Este. No. I could never because become a doctor. Uh, sería because to this this organics and can't stay hospital. <coughs> Thank you, Evelyn. Okay, read it for me. Mm -mm. Nazario, read it for me. Could, could, could. Uh, I could never become a doctor because I'm too disorganized. I can stand hospitals. Can stand, can stand, can, can stand. stand. Yeah, keep disorganized. Disorganized. Disorganized and can't stand hospitals. Disorganized. ¿Se acuerdan de los E de pronunciation, verdad? Les di un, un buen rato una explicación de cuándo pronunciar la E de, de, de con, con una D o con una T o con una E D, o verdad, cuando sí pronunciamos la extra sílaba. Ok, disorganized, en este caso se pronuncia con D. Bueno, chicos, espero eh, que ya terminen, ¿verdad? El día de mañana la sección 5, lo demás, nada más nos quedamos entonces pendiente de, um, pues, de, de algún repaso y de los otros videos, ¿verdad? Cómo discutir algunas cositas para, pues, que nos quede claro todo y que la sección, bueno, la próxima, el próximo módulo que no van a estar conmigo, obviamente, ¿verdad? Espero verlos algún día por aquí. A Rebeca sí, fue un gusto volverla a ver, Rebeca, ¿verdad? Los demás, espero verlos en algún, ¿verdad? Periodo. En algún <ríe> job. <ríe> y, y obviamente con un, con, un, con un mejor empleo, ¿verdad? Con una mejor... Eh, si, no, tal vez no empleo, pero tal vez una mejor posición en su empresa. Francisco le va a ayudar un montón también. Pero nos vemos el día de mañana. Todavía nos faltan tres días, así que todavía hay clases. Ok, bye bye. See you tomorrow. <ríe>